Hey guys, it's ATL Kitty, and today I'm going to teach you how to do the Forever Braid. The Forever Braid is a braid that goes all the way around your doll's hair, and it looks kind of like it's going on forever. This hairstyle is very difficult, so if you're a beginner, go and learn how to do braids, and French braids especially, and then try doing this hairstyle. It'll take more than one try to get it right, but don't give up. For this hairstyle, you're going to need two hair ties. You want the thin, stretchy, elastic ones because you don't want to see them in your doll's hair two to three bobby pins. Try to find ones that match the color of your doll's hair. And of course, a spray bottle filled with water and your American Girl doll brush. This hairstyle works best on dolls with medium to long hair, so you want someone like Mia or Kanani, and you can also do it on a curly hair doll like Lainey if it's long enough. So the first thing you're gonna do on any hairstyle is spray your doll's hair and brush it out. So now you're going to take your fingers and make a circle around like the middle part of the back of your doll's hair. So you want to have hair going all around the circle, like down, but you want a biggish chunk in the middle. It might take a couple times till you get the right size. And then you just tie it off with one of your ponytails. So when you're done, it kind of looks like a really strange half ponytail that you left a lot of hair out of. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is take whatever side you want to start the braid on and take a little chunk. And you're going to need to know how to French braid, so if you do not know how to French braid, there are a lot of videos on YouTube on how to do it. So take that chunk and start splitting it how you would for a regular braid. And start braiding it as if you were going to do a French braid. And then when you need to pick up a hair um, on the side that is near the ponytail in the back, you pick up a piece from the ponytail and bring it in. And the hard part about this braid is that you have to make sure you're picking up pieces small enough or uh, big enough that it will go all the way around the head. And then for the other side, just pick it up as you would a regular French braid. So when you get to the end of the braid and there's no more hair to pick up, just continue to braid all the way down and finish off the braid. When you're done with the braid, just tie it off with your second hair tie. Okay, so now this is where your bobby pins come in. Take this little piece of hair and you're going to want to shove it underneath these other hairs, underneath like the things coming out of the ponytail you made from the beginning. And this part's kind of hard. Go slow because you don't want to mess up the rest of the braid or else you're going to have to start all over. And once you get the braid mainly through, um, just start pinning down the places you want to pin down. I usually pin it, this part down because it kind of gets slumpy. I also pin down, down here because I don't want these hairs to show. So I tuck them in and I pin the, the part inside in place so it won't come out.
and then just add in pins wherever you feel necessary. Um, sometimes towards the top because it gets kind of bumpy and then you're done. Now if you want you can add little accessories like a flower or a bow. You can do it anywhere around the hairstyle. You can do it in the front too if you want and you can always also add headbands. Now this is a very tricky hairstyle and you're probably not going to get it the first time. I know I didn't. Just keep on practicing. Eventually you'll get it. You get into a kind of rhythm. The braiding gets really hard, especially towards the bottom of the hair, so you might have to move the doll around and position her the way you want her to be. But just keep on practicing and eventually you'll get it. Make sure you do not leave these braids in your doll's hair for a long time because they will leave little kinks and crimps in your doll's hair and it does not look good and it takes a long time for these things to go away no matter how long you brush them out with water. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and have a great day. Bye!